Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Lake Erie Golf Cars and we're gonna be looking at one of the hottest selling golf cars on the market right now. The EasyGo Express S4, four passenger lifted golf car is just about capable of anything. Take a look at the front of the car. The S4 comes equipped with your brush guard with mounting holes for lights in case you wanted to put any fog lights in there, aftermarket lights. It does come equipped with lights with the options to add turn signals. The lights operate pretty easy. Just a switch on the dash, but the car has to be on in order for you to turn the lights on. So, as soon as you turn, turn that key, Look at the cup holders. Oh yeah, illuminated cup holders. I don't know why I think that's so cool. It's just so cool, it really is. It gives that extra look. It actually gives you a little bit of light inside at night if you need to. Outside, these lights are gonna be bright enough to take care of anything that you may need. Um, wherever you may be traveling at nighttime, which all has, also has lights in the back so people can know that you're there. So the S4 comes with the rear seat that flips open and has a built-in cooler for you to put stuff in. And bonus, the cooler even comes out, right? So now you'll be able to clean it in case you have stuff in there or, you know, let's say you park it and you want to carry some beverages wherever you are, you can pick this up, walk with them. or Put it back in and leave it in there. That's another, another good way to keep it keep it clean. You know, it's got a drainage hole in the bottom, but you might want to you know, dump the ice somewhere else. So it's just nice to have that option there. It's just a pull tab, open and close. Now, if you're uh, if you're a fisherman, you're gonna like this. Sorry, so it's, it's a little wet. We have people washing cars, and I took one right out of line, and it's probably gonna have to wash it again now. So, if you're a fisherman, you have this measurement tool here. Right, so you put your fish on. Now I know you all catch fish bigger than 24 inches, but just in case you don't, you have an option that you can lay your fish down, clean it, cut it, cook it, or put it on ice, right? It's pretty cool. The seats, the seats are more plush on the S4. They come out more, add more of a contour. You can see how kind of a bucket feel where you sit into the seat and sink back into it. These rear seats also come with cup holders. You know, you gotta make sure that your beverages don't fly out. Now this model is a gas model with the 13 and a half horsepower engine. Look how shiny that is. It's a very, uh, this is a very efficient and capable, I, I hate to call it a golf car because it's not, there's nothing golf about this, but for lack of a better term, that's what we're gonna have to do. But this golf car is very capable of just about anything you may need outside of you know serious off-roading and, and, and mudding and stuff like that. If you need a razor, go get a razor. This is not gonna replace that. Not everybody needs one of those. They don't need a side-by-side. -side. This golf car has a lot more usage. Now, another cool thing is they have a locking glove box here, just like in the, uh, the Liberty multiple shelves so you put things up there it's even removable if you want to slide it out in case you need to put something bigger in there and look at these once again it's the illuminated cup holders then you have a place for your phone in there um, and extra storage compartments you know this is for beverages and it's got a pretty cool carbon fiber look on the dash nice texture to it you know it gives it, it gives it overall a, a pretty cool feel plus you have this dual USB charging port in case you need to charge your phone or charge anything else. It's got a little weatherproof slide on it to help keep uh, keep all the moisture and water out. But we know what everybody wants to do. How does this thing drive? Well, we're about to check it out. All 
So we're about to give it a run. Make sure your key's on. It has the direction selector down here. And hit the gas. There's no longer the choke. That's, that's old golf car stuff. Old golf car stuff. No more old golf. This is new. New technology. We don't need chokes anymore. We just get in and go. You hear the purr of the engine? I'm going a little slow so I don't hit my truck. Let's give it a little gas. So this car goes pretty fast. I wouldn't advise turning when you're going that speed. That's, that's, that's gonna be a bit dangerous. But yeah, this car has some giddy up to it. But it's not it's not gonna get you there right off the takeoff, you know? You're not going to all of a sudden hit the gas and now you're flying like, like an electric car. No, this one has a nice slow build to it in case you don't really need all that speed at once, you know? You take a wide turn with it. Now we're on gravel. We're actually not getting a lot of sliding. You know, it's got a good good grip on the tires. The tires really dug into that gravel. It really helped it, you know, hold its place and not slide around, which is nice to know. Uh, there's, if you're out having this, if you have this vehicle, you're probably going to use probably going to use it for different scenarios right and, and, and different terrains so it's nice to know how it operates on something like that um, let's see if I get a patch of grass back here to take it in nice nice strong brakes and give in to them so you really have to push them down before you lock in and slide Hills over here, some bumps. Oh, this is this is not bad. The suspension is a lot different in this golf car than, than, than some of the other ones that you might be used to. There's not as much sway in it. It's not as bumpy. When you get going, when you get going at speeds, it doesn't feel as squirrely. Now, you know, if you start if you start wobbling and it, it could get dangerous, right? Um, and if you try to turn too fast, you're gonna tip. But that's just that's that's with any golf car. The suspension handles nice on this. I could see this being a, a an all-purpose usage for you know maybe around the the neighborhood with the kids. You know, let me let this up. Took that hill, no problem. Um, it handled the, the the wet grass, no problem. These tires are these tires are are, are, are pretty good for what they're what they're being used for. Um, I mean, these tires really lock in. They really kind of hold you in place. So I would say, you know, this you can confidently get in this car and you know try to tackle some things you wouldn't with a normal golf car. So it also has a fuel gauge, so you know when you run out of gas. One of the things that makes the gas golf car so popular is it's most of these have these outdoor usage, and it's more than just it's all day usage. And once it, an electric one goes down, it's going to take all night to charge, right? Um, but the gas, you just refill it. Now, the benefit of that is, you know, is yeah, it's it's a lot easier, and more convenient. What makes it tough? is that everybody wants them and they're not readily available. So if you are interested in a gas lifted S4, go on our website, lakeeriegolfcars.com, look at the inventory. This one is sold already. And I think I got it a little dirty, so they're gonna have to clean it again. That's my fault. I'll take ownership of that. But it was fun to ride. So if you're interested in it, make sure you look at lakeeriegolfcars.com, uh, the EasyGo Express S4, there's also the um, L6, which is a six passenger lifted golf car, very similar to this. Um, and we have, of course, the uh, EasyGo Liberty that has the four forward facing seats. 
um, that I don't have one out here right now, but we do have some of the Elite L6s. So if you're looking for a six passenger, this is a very capable car that is almost identical, except for the extra seats to the S4. It's got a longer frame, but everything else on it, you're gonna get. So, you know, if you need those extra passengers, pick up the L6. If you're good with four, we have the S4. But like I said, these cars are in high demand. It's one of the hottest selling golf cars out. So if you see one on our site and you're interested, act now or it's gonna be gone. All right, thanks for checking it out. Make sure you visit LakeErieGolfCars.com. Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe for all the latest videos. We're gonna do a lot more videos coming up on some maintenance on golf cars since it's getting to be that time of year, unfortunately. Thanks. Peace.